Mississippi welfare fraud case is not looking too good for him, okay? So if you don't know, we reported a while back that Brett Favre uh, took like a million dollars of state-funded money to build a gym, mm -hmm. a, a, a volleyball court allegedly. at his daughter's school, allegedly. And, uh, you know, people like Shannon Sharp, Stephen A. Smith, they told him a new one. They said, you're stealing from one of the most underserved in states. In in the country yeah. to build a volleyball court when you played in the NFL yeah. and you made over 200 some million dollars yeah. in your career. Well, the case has been going on yeah. for a while. Doesn't look like it's gonna end anytime soon, but he's under some additional fire as he is accused of withholding certain pertinent text messages. Mm -hmm. He's failed to disclose messages that could have been crucial to the matter with the Mississippi Department of Human Services, filing a document said to be 14 pages long, which accuses him of failing to cooperate with the request for text messages. So they said uh, he's never, he has, he has failed to answer any of this new discovery. He's doing the whole, I don't know what you're talking about, the whole dummy. I'm like, Brett Favre, you do know they can go back. Oh, yeah. And look and read uh, everything now, you know, that you've done. There's a bunch of ex-girlfriends that work for the phone company that know how to find them. They know how to. And federally, if they ask for those, they can go look themselves without your permission. Yes. So. And he's he was initially accused of accepting the sum of $1.1 million for appearances he did not fulfill, but has since taken on several new angles, which has only served to make matters a little bit more complicated. So shame on him, man. Mm. I used, to like, oh, yeah. I used to like Brett Favre. I like Brett Favre as a like, football as a player. Football player. I thought he was, you know, pretty. Other but than I, being with the Packers. But I always thought he got away with more than what other players did. Like when he was sending a lady pictures of his junk for the New York Jets. Yeah. yeah. Everybody I just swept about up. That. Yeah. <laughs> he been a great. Yeah. Look at this starting quarterback. And, and then she was like, she wasn't even really impressed. Yeah. She thought it would be a little bit better seeing as you Brett Favre. <laughs> Dad, mm. not this, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, you know, my man get a few massages, they suspend him. Oh, uh, you know, my man, he, all he do is love dogs a little bit. Now he go to jail yeah, for two he years. He did two, three years. Mm. Yeah. Mike, you know. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, he hey. But, I mean, Mike, Mike, mm. Mike, was, but Mike was wilding, though. Mike was super. He had a whole ring. They got him on going. video. Yeah, he was wild. Yeah, he, he was, was wild. Bad example. And I'm a dog guy, so, you know, I, I ain't like that. I'm sorry, I hit a, I hit a But spot. Brett Favre yeah. was sending pictures of his dog. Yeah, he was sending a <laughs> right, right, right. And nothing happened. <laughs> nothing happened. No action. She was like, no, I'm going to. No, well, oh, no, I tell you what, my man have a. Con this is one you can compare to. My man has a consensual affair with somebody and he loses his job. Mm. You don't know my You don't know yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my man. man. Yeah. Right. Go to nah. Consensual. Yeah, another consensual. bad example. That no, was it's consensual. Not. Two consensual. grown people. Bad example. Two grown people. Instead of forcing your junk on people. I don't people. know what bad world example. Ryan lives in in the Barbie world. Go to WGZI.com for these stories and more. What's coming up at the Z Spot, Zach? Ryan's favorite movie. We got to talk about it, y'all. Oh, <laughs> my God. I am Let's so talk about it. Good Burger, home of the... Oh, my God. Are you really excited about this? I want you... I'm waiting for the slime to come down on Oh, man. I might dedicate this whole Z spot, Ryan gonna have Let's it. That's what we're doing for his birthday. We're gonna decorate the studio to Nickelodeon. Good burger. We can have a good burger. We have thing. a good burger birthday. Oh, he loves it. Yeah, good yeah. burger birthday. Yep. Yeah. You ain't moved out your mama house. <laughs> Might as well. Wow. This will be the last. Hey, it's your boy, the Death the Legend, Leon Rogers, and join me for the second annual Perfect Margarita Brunch brought to you by Milagro and Quantro. That's right. We're doing it again Saturday, August 26th from noon to 2 p.m. at Taboo Rooftop in the city. Now, you can register now at WGCI.com slash contest for VIP access and your chance to win a trip to Mexico. You don't want to miss this party. You must be 21 or older to get in, and it's all brought to you by Quantro and Milagro Tequila. Please.